Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy, the Iguana Ninja. What it is, what it isn't. I am here with the BRK Ghost, brought to you by Iguana Solutions. And she's giving me the opportunity to uh, lock and load this bad boy and uh, take a shot at this behemoth of a... Uh, Let me find him again? Yeah. This is set at 100 yards. Oh, yeah. We're not shooting 100 yards. He's probably only like 20. The iguana is right there. You can see him from here if you want to come on the other side of this vehicle. And you probably shoot off the roof. Wow. You ready? Yeah. You do have the, uh, yeah, he has a safety on, and I don't know if you need to load a shot or not. Uh, he's looking at us now. Oh, he's head bobbing. He sees you. He felt that. Ooh. Just move to the lower branch below where he was at, just barely. Uh -huh. Might be able to lean on this uh, vehicle here and get a clean shot. I don't know. Uh, no, I don't do Not that. really? Should still be right there, yeah. It is a 177, so it is putting a little bit smaller hole, but that's a big old iguana. Come on down, iguana. Look at him. Just a hanging. Try to get him down. He's pretty big. Oh, he just sat in the tree there. He's clearly dead. Nice shot, man. Thank you. BRK Ghost. Oh, man. 177. First time using a 177. And I think I've fallen in love again. Mm -hmm. A lot of people really like... I don't know if he's... It's almost like he's in that wedge of that tree. I don't know if he'll come down for you. Yeah, he's just sitting there. Let's wait until he goes limp and see if he doesn't fall out for us. Right. There's one more big one on the ground. You want to go try to get him? Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's get him real quick, and then we'll swap back out. Right. What do you have now? Uh, we got the pack. Atomic XR. Okay, we'll and this one's 22 cal, so he was just mm. shooting with a 17 a minute ago, but it was a higher-powered gun. Mm. Now we got the lower-powered 22 cal. There was a real big iguana around this corner, guys, and that's what we're looking for. I'd stay by these bushes this way, no? Oh, jeez. Do you see him? He's a monster. Is he? Oh, we but... spotted this iguana from really far away, y'all. I might have to shoot left-handed here. I've only done that a few times on seawalls. Oh, there he is. He sees us now. You could probably shoot off that tree right in front of you if you just walk slowly and carefully. There you go. Watch out, human in the background. You're good. It's 
slapped him in the face. Got to get that eye shot on this guy. Might should be able to hold directly. You're gonna have to change your parallax because he moves so far on that atomic. Make sure you're on about 20, 25 or your shot won't hit. Big boy's watching us. We just don't want him to dive in the water on us guys or he'll disappear. If he can take it off this ficus tree, he'll be good to go. the twitch on that one run over and drop another one on top of his head because he's so big he might wake up on you there you go really out there these big boys sometimes take two or three shots in the top of the head because they just seem to function with no brain or something How'd that atomic work out? Uh, brilliant. Spot on. This is amazing. This is, uh, this bro cock is definitely my bro. <laughs> Where's that, uh... You think you could shoot down that one you shot over here with the 17? You think you'd use the atomic and push it down? Let's see. This guy's pretty big. Y'all, we're throwing all these on ice. We're about to go get more ice because they've, they've covered all the ice. We have so many iguanas already. You gonna do the two in the tree first? Yeah. I'm oh, the other one in the tree right there. You see the alpha? Yeah. Damn. You gotta hold um over their head here because of where we're at. Okay. Um, like these two right here on the right, you're gonna have to hold like, uh, I would hold three or four over their head. Three or four see, lines. I still see the big one. Especially the close iguana, I would hold four or five lines over his head. The little one. Got him. So three or four? I would hold four or five on the little one. He's even closer. Got him. Smack him too. I think, Lou, look, this guy's rising back up. Where's the beat? Hold a four on this guy and hit him one more time in the head so you get him. Do you have I, we'll, we'll get the big one in just a second. You don't want to get that guy before oh, he about, come, oh, rises back up. I'm the bigger sorry. one kind of got back up. I see him. You said on. Hold four over, maybe. Beautiful. Oh, he did the flippity flip, huh? Yeah. Oh, he's still flipping around. Okay, so now we're gonna get this guy. You should be able to also hold just above his head, maybe one over his head. Get you where he's between these two trees. Right one or two over his head should be good. Went over him. Might've told you too high to hold. Maybe try to skim his head. Was that the hold skimming his head? Yeah, it was the line right under. Okay, okay, okay. One, one mini line up right under. It's crazy. This thing here, guys. This so he did a one hold on that iguana, and it's maybe uh, 10 yards away. Yeah, that's an eye shot. That's this this brocock, guys. It doesn't come like this. is a custom for uh, iguana solutions, but this brocock, made in England. 
and the parts are actually milled in Italy. Ooh. So um, it's all super high quality. They have limited parts and limited O-rings, so you have limited places for failure. So um, I've had a lot of luck using this gun um, through rain, through dropping it in sand. I've fallen on my gun before. All kinds of undesirable things have happened to my air guns. I'm gonna pull over right here and see if we can't grab these iguanas. CJ just shot. I think he got four. Yep. Four of them bang. With the broca. With the broca. Da da da. So the first one had been on the back side of this branch here. Oh, he's right there. The other one's there. The big boy. I don't know where he was when you took that shot. I tried to film, but I never saw it. He's right here. Right here, right here, right here. He's, yeah, yeah, yeah. You need another one? You see his gray cheek? You should be able to hit him right between the cheeks and he'll come up top of his head. This is like a 10 hold where we're at. We're extremely close. Make sure you're on high power. There you go, now you're on high. Like a 10 hold, you're holding way over his head. Perfect dangler. I'm spin around careful when you pull him out. Ah. Hang on, I'll, I'll grab him. We have a pole too and a net in the back of the truck if he's gonna stay way out there. Rising back up now. Good shot on that. A lot of people have trouble with the short shots like that. It's like, because you're supposed to just like take the bottom of the reticle and just like put it as far up as possible. Wait, he's going to come over here. I'll be able to grab him. Put one more in it? If you want, do a 10 hold. It'll be blurry, but you should be able to still hit him. Nice. All right, guys. We just took out four more invasive iguanas out of the ecosystem. Iguana Solutions, Je Jessica. We have one goanna. Two goannas. Three. Go in. This has got to be an orange one in the car. It has to be. Here's our number four jellyfish. On the Brokaw special. Oh, my phone's ringing. And the four. They start to get heavy, right? Yes. Probably like, maybe like 20, 20 23 pounds of meat right here. Guys, this is crazy. But, uh, guys, this video was brought to you by Jessica from Iguana Solutions. Also, our first time ever using the Brocock. Right? Now, this is one of uh, Jessica's sponsors. And when I first laid eyes on it, I fell in love because it's a compact, first of all. If you're not having a truck gun and you're out here uh, taking out invasive creatures, I don't know what you're doing if you don't have a compact air rifle. That was the first thing. The second thing was the color coordination. I don't know if you guys can see that, but those aren't regular scales. If it's, to my knowledge, I believe these are iguana scales on this gun. And this is just a very light gun. It's very, the handle, Reminds me of an actual, you know, AR, 
but this is this is a very beautiful gun the turning up the power on this is remarkable so if you guys don't feel safe you guys have some windows but uh this gun doesn't go that far but it does definitely packs a punch on whatever you're shooting at so shout out to brocock shout out to jessica from iguana solutions thanks so much for helping me today no problem anytime so but guys we got four of them in the with us today and i just want to shout out uh iguana solutions jessica for inviting us out and because we record for her and stuff like that so this is a great honor to even be here be with one of the legends <laughs> one of the best female shooters out here in broward county that's busing iguana matas so shout out to her and her thing uh like comment subscribe guys it's your boy the iguana ninja signing off until we see you again peace Kind of going over here at the edge of the water. I'd aim right on. Is he catching him in the jaw? Where's that catching? Yeah, you're right in the. I need to hold barely over. Ooh, we like that shot. He's dying. Yeah. He's just flipping around first. There's a second one over there. Just past the sign. I don't know if y'all can see that. We're going to turn the truck and see if we can't get a shot on him too. Yeah. Nice shot, man. All right, guys, we moved the truck. We can see the native Aninga, which is a bird here in South Florida, also known as the snake bird. And he's hanging out with his invasive iguana friend. Yeah, he's ready. Should be able to hold just barely above his eye, probably. Safety off. Yeah. Oh, he just went to sleep right there. Oh. This bro cock is my bro. He's awesome. a good bro. He's an awesome bro. He's bro tastic. <laughs> right. We're gonna go grab those iguanas real quick. Check out the Aninga. Got him right below the ear. Mm -hmm. Took out the brain well enough to take him down. We've got another one right over here. We're expecting this one to need another shot just by how it was moving. But we're gonna come over and grab him. Got both these iguanas. We've had very few get away today. Yep. Step on him, step on him, step on him now. Yeah, there you go. He, he saw me, but he didn't see you. I think his other eye is blown out on the other side. So you only see on one side. Brilliant. Brilliant. Man, we just like almost doubled our iguanas in the last like five minutes. Yep. Iguanas were everywhere when we were trying to leave. Y'all, we gotta go get some Blaze pizza. We're starving and Blaze is the only way to go whenever you're hunting up in Pompano because Blaze pizza is just so good. All right, guys, this was the one I shot earlier. I was.
All right, guys. I don't know if you guys just saw a little tussle, but this is the one I got. There's another wee one right here that Jessica's about to get. As you can see, she's right there. I have another. She has another one over there. We're gonna go get that. There's somebody walking. Right, right towards us. Like right behind that big. Right, guys we're just waiting for this person to uh safely get a uh she is now crossing the street there's nobody else in sight we are all clear okay. yeah side of it so they can see the sunlight on it. Oh, I see it right there. Look, he's a completely turquoise head. Oh, that's fire. I mean, that's a blue iguana. They don't all look like this, guys. I was just talking to another company about some really blonde looking spiny tails he gets over in Cooper City and areas like that. And man, they just really vary from place to place. These blue ones are in certain pockets and I get a lot of the blue ones out in like Lauderdale by the sea and some of the ocean edges. Um, but yeah, got you a buck. Let's go get this other one. Yeah, yeah, leave him with me. All right, guys, you guys are coming with me. All right, guys, today has been an epic day. Um... Uh, I don't know if we got all the video but we got majority of all the fire and you guys saw what i saw so shout outs to jessica from iguana solutions uh, i've been recording for her for maybe like uh like a month now because she doesn't have anybody to like record for her when she needs it so uh she's paying me and you know we have a good thing going on we're both promoting each other on each other's channel. I need to do way better on, uh, on like, you know, be more consistent on the videos and stuff like that. But there's a lot going on in my life, so. But uh, this is the one that Jessica shot from here, all the way from like right there. So it's probably like a 25 yard, 30 yard shot. still up guys so i'm gonna have to um be back my goodness gracious guys that's a one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve wait you're in the shadow you know I'm in the shadow there's 12 more iguanas that we have added to today's bounty Hopefully in the tree. I think I see one, a giant one right here. Follow the main trunk up right. and where the branches are. Oh, I see his head. I see, I see his head. Oh, so you're good, you're good. Oh, his head's okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, I thought that was a really good shot. That was a brilliant yeah, shot. He's right here, hanging on the side of the tree. There he goes. He's dead. Oh, man. Uh, I was really trying to get him in the eye. It seems to be one of the only shots that takes down the big ones. It's yeah. right in the eye. Step on him. And look, that's exactly what I got. It was only in the eye. Came out the backside of his head right there. Wow brilliant shot got that iguana it's one of the only shots that takes them out with a single shot with these big boys i cannot tell you enough got you iguana oh yeah all right i'm recording
Nice. That one, same shot on that one. Brilliant. Just flopping around. I can't see. <laughs> Leaves in the mouth. Yeah. I don't see the other one. It's right it. above that second one. I think she climbed up. Her tail is like uh, out. Her tail's still sticking out. Yeah. I see her. I see her. I see her. Same spot. I shot over. She looked away now. Oh. She's crawling slowly. I see her. I'm hitting branches. Yeah, I, I hear. She's moving as you're about to shoot. Yeah, every time actually. She's like she knows. Damn. She's counting the seconds. She's huge. Really are these like are these iguanas getting smarter, y'all? Leave a comment down below. Do you still see her? Nah, she's on that. I got him right in the head. Oh, he's dangling. Here he comes. Dangler official. Official. With that shot. Oh yeah, he's gonna drop right there too. We can get him. Right, you see the blood just pouring in the water. Yep. I want that fat one that moved that I didn't even get a shot on. It just kept moving. I don't see it now. It was really good. Yeah, that was a big female. There's some sticks right here. Oh, oh yeah, here you go. Ah, here. My goodness. You see how deep it is? Yeah. That's scary. Skyler fell in right here, and uh, Iguana Man saved me. What? Yeah, my son fell in. We were out here hunting. And my son fell in the water and my son was only like six at the time. And it gets really deep right here, as you can see. Yeah. He went all the way under and Raj didn't hesitate. He jumped in and pulled my kid straight out the water. Awesome. Shout out to you going to me. Hey guys, we found another one. We found, found the big fat girl, man. Sorry guys, my camera doesn't zoom all the way. She's a BGW. She's a BMW. I was thinking. Big green woman, BGW. Uh oh. She moved her head, now I can't see it. That's no pellets. I'm dead every time. Huh? You got the pellets with you? Right here, right here. Oh. She's still a while, and her head is out now. Okay. Yeah, I couldn't see her head. I just took a shot. I think it hit her in the chest. Hopefully in the heart. I was guesstimating where her head was because of weeds in the way. Yeah. <clears throat> and hopefully you shoot her to kill her, but she swims back. I'm telling you, there has to be a gator in here. These waters are too Everglades watery color for one not to be in here. I've never seen a gator in here, but it wouldn't surprise me because they can go up and down that canal so easily. Yeah. And that's a major canal. If you follow that yeah, canal trust on the map, me, that's know. a major one. That's, that's right what me here. and that uh, kid was talking about earlier. Yeah. That kid's the coolest kid. Yeah, I wish he, my kids would do shit like that. He's awesome. I'm just going to have the same spot. Do you want to come over favorite. a little bit to the right? Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah, I didn't see it. That's probably what it was. All I see is her chin. It sounds like there's something else moving in the tree. There she is. Right there. She just looked left. Man, she sounds like a rock. You want me to go run and get the net? Um, I don't even think we'll reach her. That what, looks deep. It is. What about that other one? I'm right in the You can see it's an iguana I shot. Oh, my from over here, it has a hole in its throat. We're going to still hold the pedal. Hang 
Hey, shooting. Thank you. Got this guy. There were people over here earlier, but if we check this tree, they're probably in this tree. They're usually in this tree. All right, well, let's go check it out. So the place complains about that tree right there. This giant tree gets tons of iguanas. Oh, yeah, it looks like it does. And then this, this, this is in that early yeah. Bushes, yeah. There were people doing yoga right here. Yeah, so that couple. Relationship goals. There's a big one right there. Oh, I see it. There's another one behind it. Oh, I see it. They're going to fall in the water, but I'm yeah. still going to get them. All right. I guess I'm diving in the water today. Oh no, we're just gonna. No, nah, I'm joking. Just... And it is what it is. Still gotta get the iguana. Silly, silly iguanas. I didn't have a shot loaded. I could have got it. Hey, doing iguana removal? Still on. That you look right here. Come back. Step back. Step back. Step back. Put the. He's on that branch to the left with that building's right. I actually, have a branch as a backstop. Oh, okay. Got him. He's dangling. Great shot. Hang on. He climbed back up. Man, these iguanas are so resilient. Hit branches in front of him. I have branches in front of me, hang on. Oh my goodness. What? There's a giant in this tree. Mm -hmm. Yes, and he's right, right up. He's gonna be, he's gonna fall right into those things. Okay, let me get this guy, cause right. he's already hit. Two iguanas right there. Y'all see both of them? Yep. That's one dangling, falling. God, he has three holes in his jaw. This is ridiculous. I'm gonna hold higher. Might be worth coming back and pulling them out the water. You know, when you have a job where they fall in the water like this, yeah. you don't just not get them for the customer. Go ahead and shoot them anyway and come back in two days and they'll float up and you can still take photos, prove to the customer you took them and uh, get the same results or better results because you got the iguanas you saw when you saw them. You can just hang it. Just hanging like a Christmas oh, ornament. You said there's big ones. But there's a giant right here. Look up there, right there. I see you, I see you. Hold on. I don't want to point it in too much. I'm going to check the air. We barely have air, so we just have a few shots that we can take here. Alright, guys. Can you show me first and then him? Yes. Okay, guys, we got a big boy in the tree over here. I'm gonna purposely aim a little high so I might shoot over him the first shot because I wanna get him in the eye so we get a kill shot off the top because these big boys can take quite a few shots. So when you get them in the eye, a lot of times that is a good kill shot. Of course, I'm shooting on high power. 18 grain JFE. Oh my goodness, Jessica! Look how pretty he Iguana is. Iguana solutions! Look at this beauty, guys! Oh, look at him! That blue gray head, I love it when they look like this. Oh, you gotta hold him better Got than that. Iguana! Oh my goodness. <laughs> one and done and this shot. is number seven for big boys today so somebody's gonna be eating these up and um i even know exactly who it is i'm just not gonna name them 
so she'll be real happy with them and can't wait to share these iguanas with her. Got you iguana. Oh yeah, that is a monster. He look a lot smaller in the trees, but where'd you get the him? The shot at? was right above the ear. Oh, that's a money shot, guys. She was trying to aim for the eye. Yeah, I didn't get as close as I'd but like. Anywhere in this vicinity is a kill shot, guys. Mm -hmm. But on these big guys, you gotta hit him in the eye to get a critical shot to where if you hit him here, just hypothetically, say she would have hit him here and he would have never got so wounded as he was, he would have ran off and went across the water. But thank God that we have one of the best shooters, one of the water. best women shooters <laughs> in Broward County. One and done, baby, God damn. There's two of them looking down there. No, it's just one, that's his leg. They looked away. There he is. Oh, got over. <laughs> <laughs> if I shoot him in the leg, it oh, there it is. What is going on there? You got the limb. There it is. There he is. Woo! <laughs> it's raining iguanas, <laughs> y'all. Huh? Watch your step. I'm gonna need a stick. Uh, here. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I got it. There you go. It's not the longest stick, but. I just need it to be strong enough to get her. She needs to wiggle out of where I can reach it if I'm not careful. There we go. Come here, Iguana. You got blood coming out your nose. Ooh. I like that one. Look at that. Also right behind the eye. It's the same shot we got on the orange boy over there. And I did get that other one that's just hanging up there, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's right here. Should probably drop a little bit too deep. We have Should I shoot her? Hold on, we still got the net? Yeah. All right, hold on. We're about to leave. Yeah, we keep We got all leave. these iguanas. And we keep finding more giants. More, and they're not even small, y'all. We can't just leave these monster iguanas up here. Uh, you guys, we I see don't it. see his head either. His head is probably He's behind. Hidden. He's in a crazy spot. What really gave him up was his tail. If you guys look at the branches, they're all in the same direction except for his tail. And that's what gave him away. Oh, I see neck. You cannot hide from Ready? the Iguana Ninja or Iguana Solution. I see his neck. All right. Fire. I'm estimating his head. He's, he's kind of sitting still now. Yeah, that was weird. Okay, I'm going to hit him in the pelvis. All right. I think I'm going to... I don't want to speak too soon. Yeah. Let me see. What are you trying to do? He's the same? Yeah, he's in that same spot. Here, walk back some. Walk back, walk back, walk back. Walk back. Should be right there. Where he was before, but right under. Oh. Yep. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. That was our shot. Looks like he's uh, KO'd up there. Are you sure? It looks like it. I can't get a good visual on he him just, at all. I was like going he... off of spikes that I could see. Okay, it looks like he just dropped. I could see the top of his eye, like the the lump above his eye, but not his eyeball. So okay. I shot just below that. Okay. I don't see him now, though. He's, he's that little dark spot there. Is he? Yeah, to the, to the left. Yeah, right there. That, right? Yeah, that's him. He just looks like leaves up there. This is ridiculous. Ooh, let me see if I can see him from below. Alright. You see him? No. Hold on one second. Hold on, guys. I gotta pause this so we can look for All the. Alright, guys. Jessica has found him. Oh, bloody hell. We'll be right back with these short I'm messages. Out of air, remember? Oh. Alright, guys. So we got fresh air. Reload fresh, fre fresh pellets. I just gotta find a fresh iguana. Yes. Where'd he go? His blood is dripping. Right here. I don't know if you guys can see it. But his blood is dripping. I saw him a second ago, but now I don't see him. He's probably should like straight up. Oh, he's oh, I see now. Okay. All 
right. You ready? Yep. Shot him right through the chin. Here it comes. Oh, don't hit me. <laughs> Yo, that iguana almost landed on us. Man, he's a big boy to see from uh, from down there. I'm gonna pop one more in the top of uh -huh. him. Uh, that came through the bottom of his chin. Yeah. And it takes a few shots to take these big boys down sometimes. Definitely. So, got you, iguana. He makes big boy number eight, I think, today. That's crazy. Yes. We're breaking records. And the iguana ninja just spotted another good sized female over there. You see her? So back to the other tree. I see her from here. She's oh, huge. Yeah. Another one. Can we pick up the one by the wall? Yes. Okay. Look at her. She's facing our way, too. And you know what's crazy? That's the same branch that those other two females are on. Is it? Sometimes yeah. they get on certain branches. It's like 40 yards. Got her right in the head. She doesn't care. Got her in the head again. Uh, that was another impact. Guys, these, you I guys are... You can't see her now. She's, she's the If you come on, uh, on the right side of me, she's right in between that little fork in the tree. Will you use your shoulder? Uh, I'm shooting over your right arm. Not a, not a problem. Impact. Trying to hit the tire so that I can get her in the eye. That's all right. That one, that last one hit the branch. I know. Ooh. Got her. Ooh. Oh, I think she landed on land, too. Ooh. Hey, Jessica. Really he going a solution. <laughs> now, hands down, guys, she's the best female shooter in Broward County. There is no debate. Here she is, here she is. Look how big she is, guys. Look That's at that, Sheila. Check this... out some of those shots. We got some pretty good grouping, actually, for how far that was. Those two shots are almost touching. And, hmm, I wonder which one actually took her out. Probably one of those. Hmm, I don't know. But we got her for sure. Oh, yeah. Got you one. Woo! Another big Sheila. Guys, this tree is loaded it is with sheilas we lost tree. what two of them in the water we lost two in the water and we got two of them so you know the 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 odds are you know all good but in two days times those two fat sheilas will rise up and there's two more down on the end so if we come back there might be four or five floaters for us to pick up might be worth stopping by all right so. um, but we'll probably just hunt those days so we'll get ones that we hunt and we'll get those and those are like bonus iguanas you pick up just floating in the water oh yeah look at this look at this pile of gold your gold is actual coin this is my gold giant orange floridian iguanas there's one more gold over there oh <laughs> i was like there's another one there's another big boy all right, guys, we'll see you guys at the truck.